My name is Bishop Kenya Michael Lolthome, Presidential Aspirant of Kenya, United States of Kenya Republic, 2022 God willing. Today I'm here at Nairobi and Bakasi village, uh, wanting to put across a few things concerning the Word of God and also politics in Kenya. And we'll see in line with the Word of God what God has for us in brief, actually. I'm going to read the book of Ecclesiastes, uh, chapter 10, verse 6 only, and 7, anyway. Ecclesiastes 7, uh, chapter 10, verse 6 and, 10 and 7, 6 and 10, and 5 and 7. And the word of God reads, There is an evil I have uh, seen under the sun, the sort of error that arises from the ruler, from a ruler. The fools are put in many high positions, while the rich occupy the low ones. The question is, in that uh, two verses, why are fools in high positions, even in Kenya? Today, as I speak now in Kenya, we have uh, so many people who are fools in high positions, both in political class union leadership and also in administration leadership. I was astonished all night, uh, the last month, I was attacked in my house by five electricians, four of them led by an Afrikaner man from Samburu, but he's living here at the Bagazi village as a watchman. They came and installed a house next to us uh, with a fake electricity, electricity for 9th uh, January this year. And actually, they are nearly to harm us. And uh, when uh, we reported this matter, although the government has taken initiative, especially the police here, boss, criminal investigation department boss, Mr. Lumu, has actually came and removed the thing, uh, you know, later on. After we fought these people and they ran away, uh, we came to realize that uh, these people are actually brokers of Kenya power. And, uh, it means that these people are in a, in a, they are in a, in a position of authority, they are fools. Because if you are actually a Kenya power boss and you let a electrician to come and harm us, to ban us, it is actually fools in a position of authority. My wife ran to state house because in that state house we have some relatives there. Uh, Mr. Lekula, wife is a general service unit there. There is also another son. Uh, you know, of uh, my wife's sister, uh, you know, who is uh, from Mount Kula and Marsabe. There is also Jesus there. So, she went to the Sylvia house, Lekula, this Lekula house, Sylvia, who is uh, a female general service unit, uh, you know, sentry in the state house. My wife stayed there from 9th to almost one month to January 2nd. And I'm surprised, why is my wife staying in the house when we can get there in the status? Then it means, also, we can say, probably, even these bosses are aware of what's happening to us. Uh, they, are, they want to, inter uh, to make our families frustrated, you know? And I put, I propose that immediately to the YouTube, uh, that, uh, that uh, we are talking and also put in YouTube, I put in Facebook, and I wrote, I, I even I told him, we said that we may get another to intervene. So, my wife stayed there for one month. Why? We have a fool with my law. It's a Saturday two liver called Mr. Aaron. And it's everything nowadays is he's actually, uh, uh, you know, trying to, 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 to play with my family. Recently, by election in Mount Kula, Marsabe, he has actually fell. From Carmel, Kenya National Union of uh, you know National uh, Union uh, Kenya Africa Kenya National Union uh, Kenya Africa National Union Party, Kanu Party, uh, of uh, you know uh, Honorable Gideon Moy. This man actually is even sending my wife to Gideon Moy office, Kanu office in here Nairobi, uh, her sister, without my knowledge. My wife, he also sent frequently my wife to set us. Uh, to go and see who, with my permission. And also my daughter, she Patricia, a very young daughter, graduate of, you know, uh, uh, for the, uh, from Bolivar, recently. Huh? 
that in this small kid is the, without my consent into the state house. Then it means we have fools in the position of authority in the state house. I am sorry to tell Kenyatta like that. He said to the guru Kenyatta. My wife now is in actually. And this man called uh, uh, my law. I don't know, uh, listen down. He started to live up in 1972. There. And it's now everything. It's being misused by this Gideon Moni, Kanu, National Union Party, to do everything. And he's uh, even alive with the Shabbat. My wife now is in part of it. I don't even my wife to see this man. You have always given a fear for now, Salah and Sosa. Eh? Moving around and, and uh, you know, all over that place. My son is a Magnolia, you know that. And his, his, his son has never been to any any university of, uh, you know, to have to be a doctor. But now he's called Dr. Dr. Samad. Eh? My son is here, no job. But the son of, uh, you know, this is my job. Which actually I've never been to any, 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 any to, to, to have any degree in any, anyway. It's called Dr. Sobel, and he's working. Huh? The daughter of this man, called Nasas, has been following my daughter, who was actually in university, in, you know, as a student of Ritwani University, Ellery. Nasas has, has no papers. Huh? Someone has no for four papers, and papers, has no certificate. Huh? I don't need to two liver. Class 2, primary school. They left the class 2 in 1972. This man, I want to Kenyatta, I sent to Uruguay Kenyatta to hold this man accountable. And he's having now a what? We have a diploma from Dexter University. A fake diploma. Huh? I don't want my wife to suffer because of this man. I don't want my family to suffer because of this man. I want him to be apprehended and put in. in. That's what I'm saying. We don't want fools in the position of authority. Huh? I am Bishop Kenya Mekong Tome, I am a, a presidential aspirant. And this uh, rubbish called Aaron is actually trying to hook my family, to destroy my family. I am now living with a amputated leg son. After this man called a sister to go and give to Al Shabaab in Martabe. My wife, I told even Uru Kenyatta, I don't want my wife to be actually in Martabe. I want her to be here and answer some questions about this man called Uru Kenyatta. You want to know why this woman is going to Kanu office every now and then? Why this woman is going to work Kenyatta set also all the time? Eh? Who is this person who is using this woman? Eh? Using his brother Aaron. I want that woman to be flown into Nairobi together with his brother Aaron today. Eh? Today I want to work Kenyatta to do that. Eh? We are not joking. So what am I saying? We don't want fools in position of authority. And I want the Kenyans to remember me and the presentation for the company to do two. I'm here in a perfect place. Thank you so much. God bless you all.